Pig, a film that a lot of people are talking about right now, and really Nicolas Cage is getting a pretty good buzz for this film. Find out my thoughts next. Hello and welcome to my channel. This is Reviews with Ryan. Today I'm going to be reviewing the movie Pig. This is directed by Michael Sarnowski and stars Nicolas Cage, Adam Arkin, Cassandra Violet, and Alex Wolf. The film is about a truffle hunter living in the wilderness and someone breaks into his home and steals his pig. Going into this film, a lot of people are comparing this kind of premise to John Wick. I'm here to tell you this is nothing like John Wick. This is not an action movie. This is a drama movie with a hint of thriller. It is not a violent movie like John Wick. It is completely the opposite. Nicolas Cage, he plays his role very well. There's a lot of motion running through his character. He has so much love for this pig. There's some really good shots in this film. There is some points where I didn't like some of the shots, but there is some beautiful cinematography uh, in portions of the film that I did like. And I will say that the score in this is top notch. I feel like it goes really well with the emotions of the film because there is points in the film where there's some suspense, but there's also some points of the film where it kind of slows down and there's some more dramatic uh, aspects to it. And with the dramatic aspects, the music comes with it and it flows really well and it makes the movie feel really authentic and doesn't feel like the movie is rushed. It has a runtime of an hour and a half. I don't feel like it's too long. It's pretty straight to the point. It's very easy to follow. It's just one of those movies where people are kind of love or hate it. And mainly because I think because it's getting compared to John Wick, people are expecting this big uh, fight em up and, and action type of film. And it's just not that kind of film. It's the complete opposite. I'm glad that it was because I feel like we get a lot of those movies and it was just something a little bit different to see. It was a different kind of side for Nicolas Cage. I feel like he's kind of the actor now that just puts out these B type flicks. And I kind of am always split between those kind of films. I like some of them. Some of the kind of films he's kind of in really weird films. I felt like this one is just, it fit really well for his role and he just played his role really well. What I like about this film also is it really develops Nicolas Cage's character. You really learn why he's in the situation that he's in, why he was out in the wilderness, what happened to him, what's happened in his life. You also learn more on why this pig is so important to him. It's more than just a pig to him and it's just really interesting and honestly, you can't not help feel uh, some type of emotion for his character. He just does a really good job of kind of making you feel for his character and the emotions that he feels. I think that's why I like this film a lot and I feel like that's why a lot of other people are kind of gravitating to liking this film. It just does a really good job of kind of getting you involved in your emotions. If you are going to watch this film, just know going into it, it's more of a character development type of film. It is a slower type of burner type of film. And also note that this was actually filmed in Portland, Oregon. So that was a really cool little fun fact about the film. I'm gonna give the film a four out of five. It really just really got me into the emotions of this film. I think that they do a really good job with Nicolas Cage's character. I think even for a slow burn type of film, it had my interest throughout the whole film and I never felt lost. I was always invested in the story. And that goes a long way also with the score and cinematography. It kept me interested. There's good visuals, good shots for the most part. Like I said, a few here and there that I didn't really care for, but for the most part, I like the camera work in this film. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you guys think of this film. I've seen a lot of mixed reviews of this film and I've also seen some good reviews of this film. Thank you guys for checking out this review and I'll see you guys in my next review.